All right, welcome back to the He's Wrong, She's Right podcast. Today we have, I don't know what we want to call them. We're it's... calling them C and O. Okay. We have, we have C and O back here behind the camera. Uh, they're not going to appear on camera. Nope. But you we're going to only hear their beautiful voices. We're going to teach Yay. them. We're going to teach them what Riz means. I don't even know what Riz means. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. All right. So now that we've introduced you, CNO, why don't you guys tell us what our what we're doing here? What are our topics? What are you what are you bring to the table? Uh, we're going to say words from our generation, and you guys are going to have to guess. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so funny. Okay. I'm trying to make her uncomfortable by making <laughs> eye contact. Even though there's no camera on her. So now start us off. As close to the mic as okay, possible. But the, can I do the second word? Because it's first You don't have to go in order. Yeah. This is this is this you're in charge. Yeah. Okay. You're in charge. This is completely B unscripted. and O, you are in charge. Yacht. Like G O T. Can you spell it for us? G Y A T. G Y A T. Is it an acronym for something? Like Go Yo Yo at the trailer. Get your ass Get your there. Ass there. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are really stupid. <laughs> or stupid. Greedy Yankee at is it, Taco Bell. Is it lowercase or capital? Capital. All caps? Oh, yeah. So it's. So a, that sounds like an acronym. Get yellow. No, no. That's it. No, each, each letter does not stand for something. What? Yeah. It's just it's just a word. So, it, so it's a slang it, it, term yeah, for. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. It can be both capital and lowercase. Is it a conjunction or? Well, then it... that makes me think that lowercase means small and capital means big. It could. <laughs> okay, so now we're narrowing it down. So it's size. Mm. Um. Okay. Is it like well, beep beep beep? Just tell us. Oh. oh. Okay. We lost. Okay, we Round lost. Yes. What is it? Tell us. It's a big butt. What? Yep. Or if it's in lowercase, that means it's a small butt? Still a butt. Yeah. It's a butt? There are different yeah. levels of yeah. Yeah. <laughs> What What kind of levels? I don't understand. The higher the level, the bigger the yacht. So is it like, you can do like mix and match uppercase and lowercase letters like medium? Yes. What? Okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. In... The hallways at school have C and O heard this term? Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh my God. Several times a day. In middle school so. already? Either in the classroom or in the halls, but. <sighs> yep. I am not ready for that. Even for drawings. <laughs> drawings? I wonder if we know any that they wouldn't know. In videos. Like stuff that's not used anymore. I don't know, maybe. All right, give us the next one. You just schooled us on this. Okay, uh, yeah, let's do Riz. Keep, keep her back. Don't let her go through those cords. Riz. Yeah, yeah I don't know Riz. what Riz is. You you, you, you implied that you know what Riz it, is, so it, you go. I don't, but I, I saw somebody for Father's Day yesterday. People were making jokes about how they were gonna embarrass their kids by saying Riz in front, yeah, embarrass their kids by saying Riz in front of their friends, like at the movie theater or whatever. So, well, I know what it rhymes with, but I'm not gonna say that in front okay. of C and O. Okay. But I'm sure you guys can guess what I'm getting at. Is it making fun of somebody? No, not even close. Is it? This is good. Wait, what? Hmm. Okay, I wasn't guessing. That's why that. parents don't know what it means. Keep her out. Does Keep it her out. mean 
Um, she needs to that they're cool. Almost. So if a parent said that's Riz or you are Riz. Oh my god. <laughs> You would say you have Riz. Yeah. What? Have? Have. Is that like swagger? Like you walk cool, talk cool, look cool, act cool? Not really. It, it could be put It's that just way, something that you really. portray? Pretty much. So you're either Riz or you're not Riz? Yes. Well, it's swagger. Swagger. Okay. Right? Like that's, Maybe. It's exactly, that's the same, same thing. Okay. Okay, do what? Yeah, the define it for us. The actual definition is short for charisma, someone who is charming or has game. Oh, Sorry. okay, okay. Yeah. And is it R I Z or R I Z Z? Double Z? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Short for charisma. I can, I can get what, down with what that. What's defining this? Is this urban dictionary or is this kid dictionary? Probably both. No, it, 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 is it's, there a, kid it's a dictionary? website called parent so <laughs> you got like the magazine I have no idea. Okay. it's defining it for parents yeah. <laughs> yes yes was it, that, was, that was a magazine right like yeah, parenting yeah, yeah. Or... Yeah, yeah. all right dog you gotta you gotta stay right here do not move okay what's the next one Sigma. Sigma? Like isn't that S I G M A? Yeah, that's like Greek letter. No. Nope. That's what it is. Not the way it's used. Nope. Oh, God. I actually don't know what it is in math. Is so. it positive or negative? Will you give us a hint? Popular. Er, positive. <laughs> positive. Did you just positive. Spell it? No. Okay, it's positive. not popular? It's a positive thing. So if somebody is sigma or has sigma, then it is a positive thing. Is sigma. Is sigma. Is sigma. Um, hmm. A cultural phenomenon. I don't know. No. Um, they have the cool things, the cool clothes, the cool stuff. Maybe. No. They have Sigma. They are. Oh, they are. Okay, sorry. Mm. This is good. And it's a positive thing. So is it kind of like Riz? Like they're charismatic? They're smart because they got into no. a fraternity no, or sorority. No. Um, no, not smart. So they're... they're Cool for they're like the kids, the kids that smoke back in our day behind the bleachers, like that. Is that what it is? I don't mean, tell them the, that. The, I'm saying the, the I mean, cool kids, not that they were actually it cool. Could be. What? Yeah, it could be. All right, she needs to go upstairs. She needs to go upstairs. Go. All right, Miss O is going to tell us the definition since we're not getting it. It's a male who is popular. But also separates himself from the crowd. Separates himself, like because from he's a friend setter or because nobody likes him. Like that's he's a, a loner. So that's the negative. Make popular, but also wants to be popular. separated. Yeah. From that's the population. omega. Omega. Popular, is... but stands out from the other popular people. No, it's email. She needs some. Okay. I don't know how to explain it. Honestly. Is there anybody in your school that you would consider to be Sigma? Am I even saying that correctly in the right sentence? Right? Question? In my opinion, no. Okay. There are probably a few kids who think they are. It's kind of like uh, some of the popular, you kind of like thinks they're cool huh something you want to think as yourself or whatever yeah it's like it's hard yeah is it the person it's hard that, to comprehend is it the person that can float between every group 
Like they can be with the jocks and the nerds and the goths and the regular I people. I think we're and... also antiquated for saying things like that. We're not allowed to call people jocks and nerds oh. and why? I I thought <laughs> that that was like a no no now. Really, you're allowed to? Yeah. Oh, okay. So that was part of the woke ever, culture. No, you can't ever, call people nerds. Ever, nerds are gamers, and they're like that's like they're. Hold on, hold on. For middle school or for like sixth grade, you yeah. ha- boys aren't jocks; they're wanna be jocks. Well, you guys also don't have sports at your school, so that's yeah, that's the whole point. <laughs> it'd be different <laughs> if you went to a school that had sports. All right, give us the next one. Do, do. Might have to put in a sound effect to yeah. kill the dead air or just cut the dead air out. You ready? Right. Yeah. Okay. Next one is slay. Isn't that what Charlotte says? Yes. She goes like, uh, slay girl slay or something like that. Isn't that yeah, in the con- every day? And, it, and it's regarding like a good outfit, maybe? Or like being all put together pretty, in pretty like much. how they're presenting themselves. Kind of. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then what what would be a better The context that I've I believe I heard in was um oh like like you said you've put yourself together and now you're like going out to like conquer the world in some essence. Yeah. Like you're gonna conquer oh, conquering the world. No, like combine both of yours. Conquering the day, conquering the event. Conquering... Oh, I thought it was like just putting together a really good outfit no, and it's kind of like combine both of yours. It's like to, from okay. from my perception, it's the same as like you're gonna kill it. You're gonna knock it out of the park. Like ah, okay, is that it? Well, it the definition is to be extremely stylish or successful. A good grade on the test, if I'm like, if I would say slay. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, Not good job. You killed him. You just say, nobody says good job anymore. Oh. What? what does good job mean? <laughs> <laughs> Are teachers writing this on the top of tests now? No, but they do say riz, skibbity. Yeah. Yep. Okay, please explain what skibbity is. Oh, because oh, yeah. when we took, was them to the, we took them to the zoo and random kids were yelling that, that at was, us. That was the uh, song, uh, that little big song with the people walking around and acting like chickens. And... Okay, mm-hmm. you guys want to guess what skibbity means? I have no idea what it is. I Crazy. assume that it's you YouTube it? something. Crazy. Well, it is. Crazy. Okay. On YouTube. Okay, what does it mean? It means evil, evil or like. What? So if kids are yelling it at other kids, that means they're evil? Or like mean or it's like They literally yelled it while we were on the tram going to oh, the yeah. other side of from from Africa to North America at the Ashboro Zoo. And there were like random kids yelling, Skibbity. All I was thinking about was the guy arguing with the attendant for oh, yeah, yeah. in his stroller. Okay, yeah, yeah. So no, so maybe they were yelling it at that guy, yeah. not at us. Yeah. Teacher, <laughs> teachers use skivity, um, so Riz, weird. and Sigma. It's so Sigma. weird. It's it so weird. weird. It's from this, it was a YouTube series called Skibbity Toilet. There's a whole account on YouTube. Do they live in a toilet? It's just no, it's a head. You have to watch the whole thing. And a net. Like, it's, it's great. It's great. It's, no, thank you. I don't it, ever want to watch that. That sounds right. so dumb. It's an animation, and it's like, only kids like it. Like parents will watch it only because the kids are watching. It. So it's probably screaming and yeah, I would never want to watch a lot that. of screaming, a lot of noise, and a lot of the same songs. That's a big fat N O on my. Oh yeah, there's end. guns. There's no, guns. no, thank you. And explosions. I made myself watch every single. Probably episode. Cash is probably watching it right now. <laughs> no, he he no he's already watched. It. Oh my gosh. He's probably watching it again. Oh my gosh. Well, we have the next word for you. Okay, what's okay. the next word? Yossify. Yossify? Is that like how you say yoss? Like, but... This is one that's like rarely you're used. Turning, you're... It sounds like justify, no. but then yas instead of yes. No. Turning, I mean, turning a no getting, into a yes. Yeah, convincing you're some, getting like... Convincing somebody. 
you need to justify this with a yes. <laughs> justify. You guys are like <laughs> close, but like way off at the same okay. time. Okay, what is it? What does it mean? A dramatic makeover or to apply several beauty filters to a picture. No. Totally unrecognizable. What? Yep. I just don't think like what I guess. So, so I was close, <laughs> but it's it's turning it's turning a uh, uh, real life four into an Instagram eight. <laughs> right. <laughs> Comprehend the words that you you youngins are using these days. It's, oh my god! It's, is it those? Is it those? Um, those um, makeup things that people people show where like it's this is how I wake up, and then they do all their stuff. Get ready with me? No, no. It filters like a picture. So it's like, like Facebook, but they don't actually filter, look filter, like filter, that. Filter, filter, filter. Yeah. Like, so they yostify what they normally look yeah, like. As if you use that's, prettier. That's as if you use AI thing. to get rid of things. It's the same thing. <gasps> no, it's not. Yeah, it all right. Yeah, I need you to yostify me and make um, you know, get rid of my crow's feet and my gray hairs. You said it was creepy. Yeah. <laughs> I mean. Can literally do anything. Oh god, I was joking. <laughs> All right, what's the next? Can one? even animate your face now. Can take take a still image of you, and completely animate. And I believe they have uh, body movement animation as well now. It works pretty well. All right, what's next? Okay, next one is fire. Doesn't awesome. that mean like good? Like like this food is fire. Yeah. That's like this. Food is delicious. What's the score right now? Two to the four? We're not keeping score. They're just schooling us. No, the internet's keeping score. <laughs> there'll be, I'm gonna, there'll be a scoreboard somewhere right, right here. There'll be a scoreboard right here for the at-home audience. Okay. I just tried to draw it in the area where it would be. It'll be it'll be somewhere right here. It's hard to do this backwards. Okay. Anyways, fire. What's the definition for fire? Hot, trendy, amazing, or on point. Pretty sure that's been around since yeah, before they were born. Okay. Normally straight fire. Formally. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> for, formal or former? Formally. Huh? Formally. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> no, no, we, no, no. <laughs> is it former, like in the past, or formal, yeah. like wearing a dress? In the past. Right wow. So I guess that's negative points. Because yeah. she's, having a, she's having a moment over here. I'm really being schooled by 12-year-olds. That's okay. <laughs> crazy. All right, what's next? <laughs> how long is this list like did you guys actually put in time with this or is or are you just making it up on the fly no there's a lot okay sure oh, oh my god <laughs> are the tears dripping down my face no okay you don't have to make up some or anything okay. okay 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 we have the next word okay except for we don't know how to pronounce it this is one that has been left behind what do you mean left behind? Like, like no one, no, like, no one uses it. No one, no one uses it. No one uses it. Okay, say it. So it's like C H E U G Y. Jeggy. C H E U G Y. This is like chewy. Cheggy. What is this? I don't know what it means, but I heard it. Cheggy. What? What? It sounds like you're chewing on something. I don't know. Well, it sounds is... like it sounds like that place that you would go to buy and sell your college books back in the day. You're like way, 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 way off. Used <laughs> bookstore. <laughs> That's what the name. It was like Chegg or something like that. <laughs> All right. Um. Okay. Give Give us the definition. Okay, okay. Something that is out of date or a person who is trying too hard. You're cheggy. Which is check is kind of thing. <laughs> we're, our, by definition, that would be us right now because we're trying to learn what the 12-year-olds are saying. Uh, 
I'm always culturally blah blah blah. I'm always blah, culturally blah. relevant. Yeah, always. we don't know how to pronounce it. So, all right, well then, do one that you can pronounce. Cap. C A P. So, like one that you wear. Oh, I've I've seen this one. It means like no bullshit, right? Something that is not true or a lie. What? See, I would think it would mean the opposite. Like that's a fact. No, I've heard it. I've heard it in. I've heard it in. I've heard it in the context. I haven't. Like people, these. It's those uh, dumb uh, broccoli hair people say it. Except, no, I'm picturing a cat with the spinner. Remember those rainbow hats with the the bents the bents cap. (laughs) All right. What's the next one? Preppy. Oh my god, guys! P R E P P Y. That's yeah. perfect. that's been, that's been around since before us. Like yeah. that, I think the eighties is when preppy. Oh, yeah. When you when they would like double pop their collars. I mean, they were back and... in our day. People would wear Abercrombie and Hollister and yeah, the really? Republic. Yeah, everybody's first job was at Abercrombie. What's the fit. What's the fanciest Mine clothes included? that you guys would wear right now? That's what it would be. Lululemon. Sure. I don't even have a Lululemon. Well, some thick graders do. The, that is insane. The, Hundred dollar leggings? No, no jackets. Like the two hundred dollar jackets. Like entire Lululemon outfits. Yeah. Besides maybe hat. My goodness. By the way, this is one student in our class. So Lululemon is the new preppy because Abercrombie and Fitch has Beth been and Stanley. saved. Stanley, Stanley. Necky socks. Not yes, see, I told you. They canceled ankle socks and now oh, they're like these con- ugly ass white socks. No. Yeah, it's, the, it's the other tall shoes. You said that while she's wearing socks up above her calves. That's mean. Rude. I'm sorry. I'm stuck in my ways. I will learn. I wear. I don't know. I don't, you have like crew cut and ankle and Wait, something else. Wait, do you guys else. know like the shoes, like Nike shoes that like go up to like your ankle? Oh, like Air Force Ones? High tops? Yeah. yeah. Those are like considered preppy. White Converse. That was considered white trash in our day. <laughs> We have white converse. We've switched it around and added Stanley. So they're like they're and they're probably a thousand dollars a pair. They're aren't they? they're adopting and, they're adopting everything that we thought was ugly as like their trends. Y'all are crazy. Oh, and ba- baggy shirts and baggy hoodies and then short these shorts. smallest shorts. So it's the eighties. It's yes. the eighties. No, it's the nineties. That's what it is. It's, the short the short shorts went out. The short shorts went out with the Fab Five oh, in Michigan. Squirt. That's when the baggy squirt. shorts came in. Squirt. Lots of shorts. Yeah. The baggy shorts and, and the, actually the socks. You guys are doing the Fab Five thing. The socks, the shorts, it all changed with the Fab Five. No, it sounds like Volleyball. early nineties to me. Volleyball is preppy too, apparently. Oh. Is that why you don't want to play volleyball? No, I just hate volleyball. Oh. oh. They're pretty soon uh Cash is going to come home like wanting some parachute pants or something. Sorry, what those, bud. What are those uh, MC Hammer pants? Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> That's a no for me, dog. No. Why not? No. Why not? Okay. That'd, that be, that'd be funny okay, seeing We have him. another word. Goat. All capital. Greatest of all time. Yeah. Tom Brady, Michael Jordan. Yeah. Stop. We, yeah. we do know that one. Okay. We have go off. It, Yell at somebody? Yeah. That means somebody's angry. No, we're, oh. racking, we're racking up points now. No, nobody's angry. Oh, no, it's like, uh, like get do, out of here. No, it's like do your thing. Like, what? Yeah, like if you're arguing with somebody, it's like you're going off on them, and like they said no, no, nothing with an argument. Okay, I don't know that. Mm. We, we actually on. want you to guess this one. We were on a hot streak. Mm. Go off a bridge. No. Oh. No, no argument, no. no fight. That's not a fight. That's yes, it is. It's like it's ending a fight. It. <laughs> that's a permanent end. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's uh, that's falling off. for the rest of your life. No, thank you. Go off. 
can can you can you say it in the sentence for us? That's probably gonna define no. it. Yeah, that's gonna give it. Darn. Darn. Mm. Would you say this to somebody that you like or don't like? That you like. So is it kind of like is slay he then? Friend. Is it kind of like slay then? Like you're doing fabulous, good job. I, Go off, it, be good. I don't it, know. It, 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 well, kind of. Good. I don't know. I'm just. I haven't heard anyone say this before, though. Okay. All right. Give it give it to us in a sentence and tell us what it means. Okay, we're going to just tell you what it means first. Because you can't put it in a sentence because it doesn't make any sense. That's I'll, why. I'll put it in a sentence because I, I'm good at that. Okay. I'm good at sentence. A phrase said to encourage someone to continue, usually when they're ranting about someone that's, or something. That's what I said. Not like no, not jump off a bridge. <laughs> No, my my initial my initial definition. That was what I said. No, it wasn't. That was. No, it wasn't. That was. Well, we didn't hear. <laughs> when they're like they're they're oh, boo -hoo, going off on a rant, it's not talking about something. You never said something about ranting. It's the same thing. You, nope. You, All right. Because you can do it at word. somebody or about somebody or to somebody. See, I know these. Serving. That goes with slay, right? Like you've got a good outfit. You're. Kind of. Serving. You're you're serving. Okay. You're you've you've done your lashes. You've done your whatever. Yeah. You've got your outfit. Yeah, you're you're, don't they say this kind of stuff in all. your Real Housewives yeah. show? Like, shouldn't you know this stuff? No, they no. They're older that they're older than me. They yeah, do but not. They, they yeah, do but they not. They they, they they have teenagers who probably do say that. Okay. But no, they're older than me. They don't know any. I've heard it. I've heard some of this stuff from the office while you're watching it. Tell you the definition. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Looking good. So yeah, mom pretty okay. much got it with multiple words. Okay. Serve. You are serving, right? That's how you say it, yeah. maybe? Is that like you're presenting yourself on a silver platter? Sure. Well, yeah, we put it like that. <laughs> Is that what you want? Oh? Huh? Is that what you want? To, for you to be on a silver platter? Apparently, I don't know. All Can right. we afford a silver platter? What's the next one? Cooking. Uh, like cooking mess? What do you mean cooking? No. What, what, what? In what world would a middle schooler just be walking around cooking? Like, no, how does that make it? That when you're no, here, I'll use it in a sentence. You are cooking. Isn't that actually cooking? Yeah. Okay, it... so is it like you're... we just roasted you? You're, you're burnt something. to a crisp? You're... Like you say about my debit card after I've swiped it too much, you're like, your debit card is roasted. <laughs> It got toasted. It got toasty. There's, there's cooked in, like, there's, you're cooking and then you're cooked. Uh, does that mean you're tired? No. Running ragged? Worn down? Beat down? Life has gotten to you? Because that's what it sounds like at this point. mean different things. Like, so cooked and cooking no, are the, not the, the same thing. The cooked one, your goose is cooked. That's been around forever. That's like, you're in trouble, you're screwed. Okay, is that correct? And then I would imagine, yeah, pretty, I would imagine that the other one is cooking. Is you're getting away with it? No, you're the one that's delivering the whatever the, the, the punishment or yeah, the, yeah, the cook. All right, define it for us. What is cooking? No, that one we thought of while the other one. So we have to think of it, the actual definition. It's just okay. some military so, like, ones. Is like, like if someone said you're cooked and like you're in trouble, then it goes, you're screwed. Yeah. Okay. That's what he yeah. said, yeah. yeah. And then cooking, like, you're doing it correct. It's just the opposite of cooked. Yeah. It's, it's like go off. Except for you're not like delivering, you're not like saying anything. Anymore. I feel like you guys just say words. You guys don't actually know what they mean. We do. I think so too. Time. I think so too. Jeez. Uh, all right, what's the next one? Okay. Uh... It's giving. It's giving? Yeah. Isn't that also fed with like slay and serve and. No, it could be harsh or good or. Oh, there are several different ways to take it. Like it's it's becoming of you or unbecoming of you. Is it when you see something and you're like, 
it's giving this vibe. It's yes and no. Hmm. Do you say it with anything else, or do you just point at something and say it's giving? No, you say it with the topic. You're... You say it with stuff. It's so, giving old people vibe. So my phone is giving me cancer. No, <laughs> no. I was, I was, I was. Not literal. I was going through an AI. Barely, barely. No, not so, literal. So the way the way AI for the most part works is it just takes a bunch of possible words okay. that could line up with the context of your previous words. Okay. And I couldn't think of what my phone could be giving me, so I just said cancer because I know. There's some conspiracy theorists out there. Okay. It's not that. Okay. Nope. Give us give us it in a sentence, please. C and O. There's a sentence that comes with it that you say. It's giving 85. I just yeah. giving like old people vibes. Like 80s vibes, old people I said, vibes. I said yeah to that. And then he said cancer. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I can. I can kind of understand it's what this is about. Yeah. It's a good pair. Come, come yeah. Down. Okay. 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 I feel like we're winning this game. There's no winning and no losing. No, I'm. I'm putting. They're schooling. Us. No, the final tally will be infinity for us and zero for them. Blame. All right. Okay, next one. The next one. Okay, boomer. There's. Luckily, like... neither of us are boomers. Are you sure? Baby boomer generation came two generations before us. Yeah. Grandma and Appa are of the boomer generation. We are technically millennial slash old people. There's two there's two different cutoffs. Yeah, old people. Sure. <laughs> you guys are rude. But they're they're you guys are what, Xenial no. or something like that? Gen Alpha and Gen Z. Yeah, Xenials. Yeah. Mm. That's hold on. Let me look this up. What generation would you be in if you were born in 2012? Generation Z, Gen Z. Is born between 97 and 2012. Chris, Chris, but then there's another one that I think is 2010 yeah. to ongoing, and that's the next one. Gen Alpha. Yeah, we're what is a Xenial? Gen Z. Gen Z and Millennial. Yeah, it's the people that are on the cusp of the two generations. Gotcha. He's outside. Gen Z. He's, yeah. Or the, the he, he, generations are like 10 to 20 years, typically. Mm -hmm. You guys are all in the same generation. We have another word. Okay. Neat. When you throw, throw somebody. Throw somebody. Yeah. Throw I'm some people you. Yeah. Somebody. And it's just like yeah. um, what you would call it, that really shitty firearms manufacturer that has the yeet cannon. Um, yeah, it's like a, it's like a catapult. And yeah, it's a yeah. catapult yeah. from yeah. ancient Roman times. No, I'm gonna yeet you. <laughs> no, it's people doing stuff. What? Like people eating things. <laughs> what? Yes, people in anger. Throwing, shooting, jumping, what? fishing. No, no, not not. Do you it's yeet your dog? No, no, like say, like say I was laying down and I was mad about something. I don't know. And I threw something at the wall. That would be me. Which you would never do because yeah. you would never damage property, correct? Yes. I okay. That. okay. I'm using an example. Okay. Sure. Willow okay. thrown things at the wall. No, blame it on Willow. Okay. Yes. Okay. You ball. you yeeted your book in anger. No, I finished all my books. They're all online now. Okay. <laughs> all right, what? Like my... boring. My God, we got one. Get that so quickly <laughs> because I'm vanilla. That's been around forever. <laughs> you know, vanilla is ice cream. Vanilla bean is best flavor. Best flavor. There's no better flavor than vanilla bean ice cream. All right, what's the next one? Do, 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 
You should have a buzzer. You just. Okay, we're going to school. Thought you were. Thought you were an organized person. Thought you had. Thought you had all this locked down. All right, give it to us. Cringe. It's like ew, gross. Word that outfit is so cringe. When mom and tries to talk to me, it's so cringe. When she tries to use our words and she it's uses so them cringe. <laughs> mom said it yeeted my brother. That's so cringe. It is. Okay. Word to describe embarrassing or awkward behavior. Yeah, that would be me. Behavior. Yeah. Okay. We kind of got that one. Gucci. Ew. Yeah, so it it is because of the brand, though. And, yeah. It means, like, good. I think you guys actually knew a lot more. Like, I thought there were a lot of, like, new things that we wouldn't actually know. You knew Skibbity before today? No. But I know it's a song. Is it? I, we just had this conversation. Wait, that... sing it what? There were a bunch of different songs. There were like a couple of really good ones. There's a song that plays in like the well, video, which is different than the other ones. Like, is it like everybody's you know, fear of you... sitting on the toilet and a snake comes up and bites you? Do you know the Little Big song? What? Little Big? No. She knows it. She knows what I'm talking about. that weird those people all right tell us the next word they're like bashing their heads in like birthday cakes no, and absolutely like absolutely not no thank you huh? no thank you you know what's that. the next word hmm find one that you guys don't know hmm. hmm sounds like it's impossible it sounds like we know everything <laughs> no mom just made a really short list you're you just showed me a list that was like five pages long so short. It's so long. There's no, there's no words. It's one word and a definition. All right. How much time are we in? Two. Thirty-seven minutes. No. I don't like that. You Ew. Know, now that you now that my claim for tinnitus is gonna go through. All right, VA, come through for him, but just don't actually give him hearing aids so he can actually hear me. I just use my earbuds. Hits different. Like, better. This, this song hits different. Yeah. Better because of the situation. It's like right. more. Uh, Something that you're emotionally attached to. They gave a. So, since we found this on a website that uh, describes it for a parent, mm -hmm. can I say the definition? Yes. Okay. It's something that hit different lands differently than usual okay so, so, yeah. like, so, so like they did the a joke deal. but if you say the joke landed or no, didn't land you guys it gave hits. the actual definition like the way we use it like we emotionally think it is better or whatever and this gave like it hit the ground <laughs> it, <laughs> it hit the ground oh it's, it's the yeah same no thing. it's yeah it's the same thing it's just it did like if you walked up to grandma and started saying all of this, it would hit different than you saying it right now to us. All right, what's the next one? You don't have to use the list. Just tell us some. What's the most embarrassing one? Or is that the first one that what you is, gave us? What is something you would say around your friends, but you would never normally say? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Unless, until we put you in this situation right now. Yeah. What is that one? What would O and C say you, behind closed doors? I think doors? we kind of ignore me. She was, she's acting like she can't hear me. Uh -huh. No, no. Okay. I would say, oh, I don't like say it to people. people. Is that the like close friends? Yas Queen Slay. That's what Sean says. Yeah. Okay. So I've never actually like 
said any of his words to either you or to friends? I don't say like any of these words. Sure. Mm -hmm. Whatever you say. No. That hits different. I can't even say. All of these are terrible. We should do it in reverse, like I said. I'm, okay. I'm stuck on the... You, yeah. you guys will think of something completely different, but this... Okay. What do you think, Red? What do you... That somebody that's oh, attracted to yeah. somebody. Oh, no. Like, if somebody posts a thirst trap on... Like, yeah, they're seeking attention. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Attention seeking. But the people that are thirsty are the ones consuming the content. <laughs> Really? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I I don't think so. It's the trap. It, the trap is the water. The person drinking the water is the one that's thirsty. I think if somebody is thirsty, that Try, means they are trying, trying yeah, for okay. attention. Yeah. Same. It's all the same. No, <laughs> it's all the same. I define words myself. Okay. Low key. L O K I or L O W K E Y. That means the god of mischief or no, it's L O W. Uh, so like it's being fighting, Phil, um, low maintenance, um, low, under the radar, not raising suspicion. Don't be suspicious. Be suspicious. What am I, what am I not knowing here? I don't know. Okay. Who's the look, is that a song? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like background noise. Uh, definition added to a feeling or desire to downplay it. I am low key freaking out. Like, yeah, that's what I said. Undercover, okay. under the radar. Okay. Whatever. Okay. I'm trying to match it to your words. We should ask you some. So I have phantom tax. Phantom tax. It's a-N-U-M. Phantom. Phantom. I have no idea. Tax as in like sales tax. No, like, like someone's collecting your tax. I'm going to steal it from you. I wonder if, I wonder if some kid just didn't know how to spell phantom. No, no, it's phantom. I know, but that's how a lot of things happen. Somebody changes the letter or doesn't know how to spell or pronounce something, then it Makes on its own separate meaning. No. So it's, yeah, it's <clears throat> it's when mom reaches over and steals a fry when you're not looking. That's mom tax. But not but, phantom tax. But, but you're doing it without them seeing it. So it's like, it's okay. Just Is he similar to the definition? Kind of. It's, um, there's a comedy creator named Phantom, and he would jokingly go say Fanny tax. Name as he was stealing from the school while they were eating it, making it known. Oh, but it was specific to this one guy who I've never heard of in my entire life until yeah, today. Everybody. So you guys just walk up to each other's lunches and just phantom tax, or or like for pencils during class or like gum. Yeah. Okay. Which, by the way, neither of you should be chewing gum with braces. She said she forgot her gum. I don't have gum. Yeah, she eats gum. My, my older daughter says she eats gum. Oh my god! <laughs> That's about me. I fully like break in brackets all the time. Yeah. I've broken one bracket, but, but it like fell off and I was using a carrot. So it's not a bracket, it's the wire popped out. Mm hmm. It did. Mm hmm. Okay. That's how you broke yours too, right? From a carrot? I never broke my braces. Crunchy bread. Crunchy bat bread. That's right. Yeah. I, was, I was eating a croissant. I never broke my braces when I had braces. Who was a carrot? Somebody with a carrot. Was it Cooper? Cooper. Yeah, it was Cooper that was uh, a carrot. So, what does rad mean? I say rad. But what does it mean? Did That's you change straight the straight eighties? Did, did you change the definition, or do you use the definition as it was forty years ago? Mm -hmm. Or do you even know what it means? Do you just say random words just to fill the void in your life? No. <laughs> I wonder if I wonder if Cooper has like a dictionary or encyclopedia for the random nonsense that he spews. Like what that term 
meant in that moment and when he repeats it, if it has the same meaning each time. Mm. Like when he walks around just randomly oh, says cheese. Is like good. Yeah. yeah, like O says radical a lot. Yeah. O? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Duh. O. It also means crazy. The way, the way that you were saying it, I was thinking we were talking about some other O. What about... What about... Mm, what are things that we said? Everything that we said is like just now common, so it's not... Yeah. Uh, Actually, no. Because a lot of our slang is now viewed as like bad. The only, the only thing that I grew up with was like, you know, the preps, the jocks, the and that was it like i don't have any no but it was term. no but it was like more acceptable to use like other things in a derogatory manner mm, like if you call not, yeah like if you if somebody was being cheap school. if somebody was being cheap you would call them a jew no yeah. what yeah. no yeah. that sounds very offensive yeah, yeah. yeah. No. but <laughs> it wasn't 40 years or it wasn't as it would be. offensive sounding to people 40 yeah. years ago as it is now i never grew up with huh? that what? how that's like the same way like 80s movies could get away with a lot more so call it like pg M maybe yeah. Yeah. we talked about this the other day like a movie in the 80s could get away with like a lot more like, no it's actually no it's, it's the actually other way split. around yeah. yeah the other way around so it would, it would be like rated r or rated pg-13 yeah. for just like if you can only get away like with wearing a bikini or something you like can, that you can whereas only... now that in a PG Disney movie. You can all get away with saying fuck one time in a movie right now without it being rated R. But previously, you couldn't even say like bitch or anything on TV, even though it's an actual scientific term for a female dog. You still couldn't say the word even mm -hmm. in that context on cable TV. You could say it on like HBO mm -hmm. if it was a subscription only thing. But the, the thought was that if a kid can pick up the remote, Right. And just on over the air broadcast, hear it, mm -hmm. they outlawed it. But now you have access to basically everything. Right. They try to like do it. Gibbity toilet. Yeah. I'm so disturbed by yeah. that. Yeah. <clears throat> really least... good? No, tell Crash to stop watching it's it very then. Entertaining. Kids like it. I don't. You watch Real Housewives. It's the same thing, in my opinion. A bunch of screaming people talking about I their mean, first world problems. I mean, yeah. Terrible CGI guys poking their heads on toilets and being shot at. Speaker or explode. What? Speakers, cameras, TVs. Do you know what dope means? Dope? Yeah. Cool. Do you know what the other definition is? <laughs> what about hmm, grass? What? I was wondering if they use these terms. Does grass mean don't drugs. even don't even go down well, yeah. the, don't even go down that path? Yeah. Don't no, I'm asking. Yeah. I'm, I'm asking if I'm asking if they know it. If kids in their school say it, no, no. Right. What do they call it? If they talk about it, if it? kids in your school are talking about drugs, what do they call them? Drugs. Like if they on the news, they're like, oh my God, they were talking about drugs on the news. See, keep them innocent. Do not go down that path. Yeah. <laughs> do not go down that path. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm just asking if they know the words, not if they do them, but you shouldn't do them. I want to know if you know the words. Okay, what else you got? Give us one more, mm -hmm. one one good one, one last one. Hit us with your best shot. We hold on. Give me the top five most used slang terms from the nineties. There we go. Hey, we can hear you. Talk to the hand we... as if. 
You guys know what booyah means? What does it mean? It's like a, you're like, it's like saying yes. Yeah, but you're like doing it to someone. Like you just beat them in the game or whatever. What about why? It's, you guys have said variations of that. Yeah. Do you know what bling is? Bling? Yeah. Jewelry. I got my bling on. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> is it like fly me like? Yeah. Yeah. Home skillet. <laughs> what? Like your best friend. <laughs> so, I would see our home skillet. Plural. I used skillet. They used a beeper for the word <laughs> not. <laughs> what about chillax? Oh, like relax and chill. Yeah, yeah. 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 Chill, no, it's chill and relax, not relax and chill. This is one you guys use. No duh. Oh, snap. No, we use no dip. Sherlock. No, Sherlock. Sherlock. <laughs> Why dip? Why dip? I don't know. No dip, Sherlock. We just got rid of the duh. Must be shit. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You can't send it to school with no dip. Right. Using dip, Sherlock. Oh what God. about crib? Oh, a crib is hot. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I know that. What about bounce? Oh, like leave. See? I told you all of ours are common now. No, I got those too. Eat my shorts. <laughs> There's something, I don't know. I think it originated with Bart Simpson, but. Oh, it's, like, it's like for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you Googling it? Yes. Oh my God. What about Scrub? It was a whole song. Yeah. No? You don't got it? Wi-Fi is not Wi-Fi. working perfectly fine. Clothing? It's not a tree, is it? <laughs> that would be a shrub. <laughs> a, a scrub is like a loser, doesn't dress good, person that you don't want to be around. They don't, yeah, it is. I'm sure scrubs came first. Okay. Do you guys know what I Y K Y K? If you know, you know. If you know, you know. Mm hmm. What is crunk? Oh, that was the, the drinking thing. I was looking at this picture. It looked like an airport. And I was like, what the fuck does that mean? What about talk to the hand? That's what you do to Charlotte every day. Yeah. Talk to my hand. Yeah. Yeah. Don't know. That's pretty much it. All right. Well, thank you for schooling us, C and O. You guys have been a delight. What is being? I feel dumber. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I've lost brain cells. You got a lot more than I thought you did. If you are watching this video <laughs> and you made it to the end and you know all of them, tell us your score. Okay. Yeah. And then Chloe said that I'm supposed to tell you that you have to like and subscribe because she found that it's psychologically. Viewer satisfaction. Yeah. What? How? Like people. How's that satisfy them? No, people will actually subscribe. If you tell them to. You heard them. And also, also, YouTube had an update where if you tell if you say subscribe in the video, the little subscribe button will actually sparkle, and when you press it, it like it explodes. It's great. Okay. okay, so subscribe just so it explodes and sparkles because you guys can't see what O is doing behind the camera, but this is what yeah. she's doing. Well, the audio <laughs> audience can't hear us or can't see. Can they, I hope they can hear us. <laughs> I hope. Yeah. We'll find out tomorrow when this airs yep. at 6.30 a.m. Yep. So thank you. Thank you, CNO. You guys oh, have yeah. been amazing. Wait, we won, right? Let's just be clear. No. No, I think they won. No, I think no. they won. I won. I think the twelve-year-olds won. Mm. Yeah. No, she didn't get no, like Google, any of mine. Google won. Oh, Google won. There you go. <laughs> and I am Google. Oh my God. Uh... I'm the Oracle, personified.
my laptop <laughs> one. <laughs> All right. Thanks for coming to this different kind of episode where we don't talk about crime and dumb people. We just talk about us our, being dumb. Our lack of understanding. <laughs> Dem being dumb. Twas a hoot. Yeah. You sound so scholarly. Twas a hoot. Oh. You said scholarly, but I thought you said Scotlandy, and I was like, what? Scotlandy. Scotlandy, too. As he's already said, he has tinnitus, and he can't hear. So. Well, he screamed in this ear, so I mean, <laughs> when she, whatever that, whatever it was. Anyways. It was about the yacht thing. No, no, oh, no, it was about, about the, the skibbity toilet. Oh, my God, she oh, showed me the picture of it. It was terrible. All right. Okay. Get, get subscribed. We yeah. still have the 500 subscriber Sub giveaway. Subscribe. So. Sub. Scribe. Is that what you said? Subscribe. <laughs> you, go. you guys are cute. Comment. Right. Comment. Like. Share. Yes. Yes. Copy link. Learn Hello, what your 12-year-old is saying behind ask, your back. <laughs> ask your kids if they are using these words at school. Definitely like, go to them and just say, yeah, you're stupid. Right? Oh, my God. Yeah. Please yeah. do, please do, please do. Yeah. Oh, they tell us about it. We dare you. Wait, yeah. no, we dare you. Say, say skibbities for dinner. No, Riz, right? Skibbities oh, for dinner. If, if your kid asks what for dinner, say like skibbity slicers or Sigma meal. Yeah. Sigma meal. Sigma meal. Sound, sounds like we're crossing into a different territory. Yeah. Right? Nope. It's not. If you, so guys, if you guys could see their faces, you'd think they're being suspicious. No, they need these two. Okay. I, th I think we're being misinformed, yeah. but I don't know. Find no, out. No, parents, parents say that, please. Okay. Uh. <laughs> All right. Thanks for thanks for tuning in. Thank you. Thank you to our first officially aired guests. We are great tutors. We're so good at this. You yeah. guys are great. Yeah. We All really right. appreciate you too. Bye. Bye.